going to go back to school on Wake Up See Buzz here. Let's talk about this. Social media, self-doubt, stress, and anxiety. Seemingly adult mm -hmm. issues, right, that some teens nationwide are tackling every day and oftentimes on their own. It's a lot for a young person and their parents to process, which is why a Westerville High School grad created a guidebook for teens. Tracy Townsend has the story of her story. Never judge a book by its cover. I think um, the title can kind of, you know, throw some people off because it's how to survive as a Christian teenager. Author Maya Chafin says all young people, in fact, who read her book can pick up principles to help them navigate life as a teen. Life as a teenager now is hard. It's, it's very hard, especially when you have social media. You have, you know, people pressuring you to do different things that you don't really feel comfortable doing. Chafin was inspired to write the book during the pandemic lockdown when she was a student at Westerville North High School. A lot of sense of loneliness, you know, school was online, it was on Zoom calls, I had to do AP chemistry online, which was awful. Right. <laughs> um, and just having to be isolated from a community was really hard. And a lot to overcome for this scholar athlete turned author. Chafin shared with us some notable lessons from her journey. The first, a reminder to her peers that you are never alone. But I kind of wrote in this devotion a story about um, how there's a day that, um, you know, 2020 was a very big deal with um, the Black Lives Matter movement and, you know, um, just students of color who were um, treated differently. And I really felt recognized and heard and seen by one of my assistant principals during the time. And um, God really comforted me through that person. Next, that grudge you're holding against another person, let it go. So, it says, if you think about it, holding a grudge against someone is just more stress for you. If you can't stop thinking about how much they've hurt you and don't release them from your life, you won't have eternal internal peace and love for others. Don't compare yourself to others in school or on social media. Be yourself. It's okay to be yourself. It's okay to continue to grow into who you're supposed to be. You don't have to be like everyone else and you don't have to fit in with the group. You don't have to always follow the crowd. Hers was a divine realization that she can only be Maya, now a college student working to realize her dreams with a word to help ensure other teens tap into their potential too. Tracy Townsend, 10 TV News. And Maya Chafin started the school year at Howard University earlier this month. You could find her book right now on Amazon.